I did not expect that first post to get over a half million views, but I'll answer some of the great questions that came up in the comments, starting with this one. Can lean people get diabetes? Definitely yes, and it can lead to being underdiagnosed. The simplest way to explain this is that I have patients that weigh over 400 pounds that do not have diabetes at all. And I have patients who weigh 110 pounds that have diabetes, even type two diabetes. So let me explain. There's really two layers to this question, and it's really important to understand both, so please stick around. The first layer is that when most people are talking about diabetes, they are referring to type 2 diabetes, which is honestly fair because the overwhelming majority of cases of diabetes, at least 90% are type 2 diabetes. But the remaining 10% or so are made up of other types, such as type 1 diabetes, MODI, transplant-induced diabetes like we talked about, or pancreatic diabetes. And with these other types of diabetes, there's no clear correlation to body weight. So people of all sizes should be treated for these types of diabetes. Now onto the second layer. Even when it comes to type two diabetes, lean people can still definitely get type two diabetes as well. Now, let me start by saying that there's definitely an association between having higher body weight and having type two diabetes. For example, we know that people with a BMI of 30 or more have three to seven times higher likelihood of developing type 2 diabetes. From a recent data set published in 2021, we know that of all the people with type 2 diabetes in the United States, about 90% of them have a BMI of 25 or higher. But if you look at that last statistic, that means that one in 10 people with type 2 diabetes have a normal BMI. And to add some context to that a little bit, here's a list of various heights and the max weight that they can be to still have a normal BMI. So for example, a normal BMI for someone that is five foot eight inches tall would be under 165 pounds. So while having a higher weight increases your risk of having type two diabetes, you can still be lean and have type two diabetes. And interestingly enough, and bad for me personally, People of certain ethnicities, such as South Asian, Hispanic, African American, or Native American descent, are more likely to have type 2 diabetes at lower body weights than their Caucasian counterparts. So the bottom line is this, no matter how much you weigh, it's important to make sure you are getting screened for diabetes if you develop symptoms such as excessive thirst, frequent urination, fatigue, or undesired weight loss.